she's deep sleep. This is the creation. Before there was Earth or Sky, there was the Ginngagap, Muspelheim. Lay to one side the realm of fire. Niflheim lay to the other. Land of eternal ice. In between only silence and the dark. One hundred boars, three hundred cask of ale, two twenty deer, three bears, forty oxen, one lettuce for healthy. Enough for feast. <laughs> The Aesir, being vain and desirous of inferiors to worship them, created their first humans. Ask an Embla from two trees. Afraid of the wrath of the Jotnar, they built a fence around Midgard to keep us out, and left them there to thrive. Penned, penned like chickens with the foxes at bay. blood came the oceans, his skin and muscles became soil, and his hair the plants that grew there, the clouds are his brains, the sky his skull, held aloft by, our, by four dwarves. Wait, is this not it? Huh. Ha! Here it is. Carving of linked rings. Second, where the silver rings fashioned by Aiden to encircle the nine realms. Ooh, moonstones. Triskale. Fourth was the satyr which we spoke, the first language of the nine realms. Fifth was the armor we donned to guard our bodies against cosmic shocks, warrior facing flames. Sixth were the vessels into which we sent our Huger. First were the four towers of iron to capture and disperse the sun. Third were Edun's apples to amplify the huger of all creatures. The mead. By this strange magic might the Aesir evade our doom. Hurricane has promised answers at the well of Mimir. I need to figure out how to fuck to. Man, how to get up there. Oh. Harvey! There! See? The robber caught red-handed. Betrayer! Deceiver! I treated you as an honored guest, and this is how you repay me? I saw you at the feast, Loki. Small wonder you disguised yourself after all you have done. Someone needed to warn my people of the treachery in your heart. Suttungor, show this Aesir how the Jotnar deal with thieves. Okay. Come! Embrace your death! Alright, boy. You're not going anywhere. Deceiver! False tongue! Dishonorable trickster! Uh, I should take cover. Ah! lived too long to suffer one such as you. Your bones will splinter beneath my boots. Have you done oh, with my shit.
Be thankful it was me who took your meat and not Loki. What I do, I do for the safety of the Aesir and Vaniad. You will change countless fates, Harvey, but not your own. We will see. Hidigan said to find her at Mimi as well. I will deal with this venomous trickster another day. And here are the Stormbringers. Explain this mischief. This Tempest is our vengeance! Cold winds for a cold heart! Three times we asked for Kun Lord's hand. Three times we demanded she choose between us. Three times my brother's hideous face drove her away. <laughs> it's your face, shitwit. We're twins! You can't shoot the storm because your feelings were hurt. This storm is the storm that rages within us. The noble pain of those wronged in love. The lady said no. Move on. I don't like your tone, Aesir. You think you're better than us, just like she did. Maybe it's time to shut your mouth. Why don't you come and try? The skies have cleared. The blizzard is over at last. Giants of Finland. Mm -hmm. right, let's get the rest of these treasures real quick. Warning to the troops. Listen up, vermin. I see you slacking off. Slow to your post. Scabbing with your fellow snot rags instead of watching out. You think the Aesir are going to be content to lick their wounds after the bruising they just got? Wrong. Those moist little milk toasts can't wait to stick a knife up your arse. <laughs> Unless you shape up, they'll be all over this camp like the boils on your mother's face. Anyone else I see pissing about and watch gets a kick and they won't forget. I wonder who wrote that shit. Damn, bro. <laughs> Tense. There's another feast in Utgarde. As if this place wasn't grim enough. Plate. Been working like some mangy thrall for longer than I can say, forging iron for a great assault. Then when those hop-footed claws get themselves slaughtered by the I Aesir, they... hands on that stunty little godling. <laughs> then when those hop-footed hop-footed claws get themselves slaughtered by the Aesir, they blame it on my armor. Well, I've done my part. Sharpen your own swords, boys. I've I've I have a skin full of meat to drink and a dozen after The Aesir could still be about. Where are they? Okay. There's a key. Hardy, he called himself. 
Serpent tongue, I say. Let's see. Tungur is always thinking. Don't trust anyone that thinks that much. Up, bro, come back here. Okay, I figure out how to get up. Up the highest point of your tonight. That looks sick.
Ooh, shit. Damn. The roots of the world tree Yggdrasil feed from the well of Mimir. I am close. I sorely underestimated the heft of your balls, Oathbreaker. You dare show your face. Oathbreaker, I did to you what you did to my son. This is only fair. And Sutungar, what of him? Don't blame me for your own lack of character. You stole the mead. For the safety of my people, Loki. For Asir, for Vanir, for all of Asgard. But not for Jotnar, not for me. You let the Jotnar into Asgard. So many dead, all so you could smuggle in your son. He was not safe here. They knew what he was and knew what he would become. Just as you do. I swore to you I would not harm him. That is the truth. That is the truth now. But how it will gnaw at you, knowing that to kill my son will undo your doom. Release him, Harvey! Release Fenrir, or I swear, I will kill you, here, and now! You are out of favors, Trixer, and you are welcome to try. Oh. Okay. Whoa! I wait till Ragnarok, when you can die now. Curse you, Loki! We were like brothers once! When my son is loosed from his bondage, he will ravage all of Asgard! Let's see if you fight as well as you lie! I will feed your corpse to Fenrir. Get boy. Are you finished? Curse you, Harvey. Your own distrust has undone you. Now go, and do not show your face again. I cannot be other than who I am. All this was fated. Or this will happen again. But you will not be here to see it. Do not be so sure of that. The game is not over. The game is never over! Oh, what the fuck? Wow. Gone. To who knows what mischief. But I will not see him again soon. What the fuck is that? It's fucking head. Bring the meat as soon as you can. That Mimir? Holy shit, the bro. The probabilities lead us here. Oh, what the fuck? The calculations give us hope. Speaking with someone? Do you have the mead? I do. Must I drink it now? Not yet. For once you drink, your Hugur will take flight and be ever fixed. Drink only when the hour of your death approaches. Then why are we here? When Ragnarok has come and gone, this place will remain. Remain and remember. Wise Mimir, Keeper of the Well, give me your counsel. You who seek immortality may find it within these waters. But there is a price. As always. The mead is not magic alone. It requires the sacred waters of Mimir's well to ferment into its final state. 
Before you take these waters, you must infuse them with the blood of the Asa. To remember you, it must know you. Surrender a part of yourself to the waters that nourish the world tree. Only then will you have that which you desire. I've seen the price of wisdom. What of the toll on Midgard? How will that save me? You yourself have lost much for wisdom. Beheaded by those who did not value your learning. My Hugur is here. That is all that matters. I have learned to live incomplete. As will you. And if I make this sacrifice, what then? While death and ruin rage all around, the world tree will keep you. Your body will die, but your Hugur will live on here. In time, you will be born anew, into a new world, birthed from the ashes of the old. Oh, shit. Do you vouch for this strangeness? I must believe it, for there is one I love dearly who depends upon it. And there is no other way. None. It seems I have no choice. You never did. How much would you sacrifice to be freed of fate's shackles? Would you give your tongue, your hand, your sight? I would give all that and more. Sacrifice has been made. Whosoever drinks of the mead, the world tree will remember them. And you? What is your sacrifice? My liberty. Sutungar and Gunlother will not forgive this trespass. They will hunt me now to the edges of the Nine Worlds. What are they to you? We ruled together for a time, a noble triad, as father, mother, and the sacred voice. Six times we tried to blunt the fangs of Ragnarok, and six times we failed. The mead was our seventh. But they feared how it might change the humans for the worse, so they locked it away and banished me from Utgardr. By your efforts, mm. you have returned to me what is mine. The ashes of my husband. He made his own sacrifice for knowledge. With a few changes to this mead, I may undo old sorrows. Do as you will. I've had my fill of this cursed realm. Bright mind, heart's ease. Beloved, I will not fail you again. Wow. My work here is done. Now to ask God to save my people. The scene oh. of a wedding, hidden from outside eyes. Who was it meant for? Thor, bro. This is close for Oh. Dead ships. Their skeletons washed to shore. There was great ruin here.
Battle between Thor. Okay. And we're done. Five master points. Settle your mind, and tell me what you have seen. Strange things, Volka. I'm learning much and seeing more than my mind can understand. Go on. In Jotunheim, I sought and found a mead of incredible power. It promised a strange effect. To drink it would deliver me from death, shield me from the destruction of Ragnarok. By this mead, I hope to live beyond my own death, well into the future. Fascinating. Was that your final vision? They have not ended, not yet. Something compels me to return to Asgard. The elixir is ready when you are. Oh shit, wow. Well. 